Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel, Regular Learning Academy. I am Dr. Krishna Sarkar, Department of Electrical Engineering. Here in this session, I will be going to discuss about state space analysis example three by using direct decomposition technique. This is lecture series on state space analysis lecture number 12. So our topics name state space analysis example three by direct decomposition technique. What is the example? Obtain the state space equations along with state diagram and signal flow graph of the fourth order differential equation. This is our fourth order differential equation. A into D4 yt by DT4 plus B into D3 yt by DT3 plus C into D2 yt by DT2 plus D into dyt by dt plus E into y of t equals to u of t. u of t equals to reference input. This reference input may be step, ramp, parabolic, impulse, or sinusoidal, any type of input you can apply. And y of t equals to system output. And this output, when rate of change, then this is equals to velocity. Again, d2 yt by dt2 equals to acceleration. So output changes from position to velocity, velocity to acceleration, and acceleration to higher order. So yt changeable or variable term. That's why put y of t equals to state variable. From this equation, determine the state equations, state matrix, state diagram, signal flow graph, and stability. So start solution. The given equation can be written as, this is the equation number one. This is the equation number one, and ut equals to input, where yt equals to output. So put y of t equals to state variable. Put here, taking the state variables that is taking the state variable for equation one. Y of t, this is output y of t, this output y of t equals to x1 state variables. So first state variable x1, differentiating both sides, and we get left hand side dyt by dt, or y dot t equals to right hand side x1 dot equals to again another state variable x2. So this is equivalent to x2 state variable. Again, differentiate both sides with respect to t, and we get d2 yt by dt2, left hand side differentiate, and y double dot t equals to x1 double dot equals to x2 dot equals to another state variable x3. So d2 y of t by dt2 equals to third state variable x3. Again, differentiating both sides, and we get d3 yt by dt3 equals to y triple dot t, y triple dot t for second order here, x1 triple dot and x2 triple double dot, x3 dot equals to x4. For third order, fourth order system, again differentiate both sides and we get, and we get d4 yt by dt4 equals to y4 dot or y4. Four dot t equals to y x four dot x one four x one four dot x two dot triple dot x three dot double dot equals to x four dot. So d four y t by d t four equals to x four dot. This term equals to x four dot. Put here d x four dot and d three y t by d t three equals to what? D three y t by d t three equals to x four. This is equivalent to x four and d2 yt by dt2 equivalent to x3, and this is equals to x2 state variable, and y of t equals to x1. Just put here x1, x2, x3, x4, and x4 dot, x4 dot. Then we get step two, substituting the values obtained in equation one, we get, this is equation one, this is a into x4 dot, plus b into x4, plus c into x3, 
plus D into X2 plus E into X1. So X1, X2, X3, X4 and X4 dot equals to U of T. And what is the value of X4 dot? X4 dot equals to minus E by A into X1 minus D by A into X2 minus C by A into X3 minus B by A into X4 plus 1 by A into U T. This equation is called state equation because left hand side only derivative terms and free of derivative terms right hand side, free of derivative terms, right hand side. And this equa equation equivalent to x dot equals to x plus bu. The state space equation can be represented as follows. So step number three, state space equation. What is the state space equation? x1 dot equals to what? x2. x2 dot equals to what? Only x3. Others terms zero. And x3 dot equals to only x4. And others terms coefficient zero. And x4 dot equals to minus e by a x1 minus d by a x2 minus c by a x3 minus b by a x4 plus 1 by a ut. This is equation 6 and already proved by state space model. So substituting the value obtain the equation x4 equals to this. This is already proved. So this is the state's equations. These are all state equations. So then state matrix, what is the state matrix? Step number four, the state space matrix can be written as left hand side, x1 dot, x2 dot, x3 dot, and x4 dot. So put here x1 dot, x2 dot, x3 dot, and x4 dot. And coefficient 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0. Third, x3 dot equals to 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. And x4 dot coefficient minus c by minus e by a minus d by a minus c by a minus b by a these are all coefficients and x1 x2 x3 x4 and u of t coefficient 0 0 0 1 by a so this is the state matrix this is the state matrix and this is equivalent to x dot equals to x plus pu where x dot equals to this a equals to this matrix and x equals to x1 x2 x3 x4 matrix B equals to 0, 0, 0, 1 by A and U equals to U of T. So this is the state matrix. Again, A is the constant mat system matrix of order N cross N and B is the input coupling matrix of order N cross R. U is the is a N cross R input matrix and X equals to X plus B is called the state equation. Again, Y equals to CX plus D U. This is output equation y equals to cx plus du where y this y equals to m cross 1 matrix and this is the output vector and c is m cross n this c equals to m cross n system matrix and d is a m cross r this d equals to m cross r transmission matrix so y equals to cx plus du is called the output equation here in this problem m equals to 1 then y t equals to x1, output y t equals to what? y t equals to always x1. Then output y t equals to 1, 0, 0, 0, x1, x2, x3, x4. This is equation number 10. So what is the y of t? y of t equals to only x1 plus 0 into x2 plus 0 into x3 plus 0 into x4. So y t equals to y of t equals to x1. This is the output. Step number five. Now comparing with the equation seven and eight, we get A equals to this matrix and B equals to zero, 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 one by A matrix. Again, comparing with equation nine and 10, and we get C equals to one, zero, 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 where D is the null matrix and Y equals to CX. When D equals to null matrix, D equals to zero, that means Y equals to CX. CX. Then draw state diagram. First equation, what is the first equation? x1 dot equals to x2 and x2 dot equals to x3, x3 dot equals to x4 and x4 dot equals to minus e by a x1 minus d by a x2 minus c by a x3 minus b by a x4 plus 1 by a into u of t. This is the equation number 4. From this equation, draw. By using the state equation, we can easily draw the state diagram this is follow shown in figure. This is shown in figure. This is the equation. This is the state diagram. So 
what is the process this is the fourth order system so put first four 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 summing pointer comparator comparator one computer two computer three computer four for for fourth order system put four integration integration one two three four in this position this is the export dot export dot integrate this is x3 dot x3 dot equals to export and x3 dot integrate x2 dot x2 dot equals to again x3 and x3 dot integrate x1 dot x1 dot equals to x2 and x2 x1 dot equals to x2 x1 integrate again x1 again integrate x1 x1 equals to y of t so what is the coefficient x1 coefficient this is the x1 value y t equals to x1 x1 into minus e by a x1 into e minus e by a so this equation e by e minus e by a into x1 and next term this is the d by a into x2 and this is c by a into x3 this is this path minus b by a into x4 so this is the export dot export in this position export dot equals to minus c by e by a x1 minus d by a x2 minus c by a x3 minus b by a x4 plus 1 by a u of t this is the state diagram and draw signal program from this equation draw signal program this is the signal flow graph for third order system fourth order system this is first competitor second competitor third competitor fourth competitor fourth integration 1 by 4 1 by s 1 by s 1 by s for integration and first feedback minus b by a second feedback minus c by a third third feedback minus d by a and fourth feedback minus e by a so this is the signal flow diagram for a linear system model thank you